Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks. And today I'm gonna to show you how to force the Google Messenger app to send MMS messages. Now this is mostly just a quick tip, but I'll give you some background first. You see, when you send a text message that's longer than 140 characters, some carriers will break it up into multiple SMS messages. That's because the SMS standard was invented in the 1980s, back when one kilobyte was a lot of data. So they had to draw the line somewhere, and 140 characters was a cutoff. So anything past 140 isn't truly compatible with SMS, which is why some carriers break it up into separate messages. But that's annoying, and it certainly isn't necessary when you consider that we also have MMS, which allows for much larger messages. Well, the Google Messenger app for Android will actually allow you to convert any message into MMS at the press of a button. So if you have a carrier that sends segmented SMS, it'll be converted into a single MMS message. To try this out, the next time you're typing a long message, pay attention to the area just underneath the input field. When you start approaching 140 characters, you'll see a little countdown. When you get past that point, you'll see a second number with a slash two after it. That means your message would normally be broken down into two SMSs. So to prevent that from happening, just long press the send button in Google Messenger. You'll feel a little vibration, then you'll see a subject field above your message. Just type anything into this subject field. Even a single space will work. Once you've done that, you'll now see MMS beneath the send button, which means your multiple SMS message was just converted into a single MMS. So from here, just hit send, then the person on the other end will only receive one message instead of two or three. It was hidden in plain sight, but it's a handy trick if you didn't already know. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article on our new site at GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.